Thank you, Yekaterina. Uh, hello, everybody. First of all, uh, I would like to make a short introduction to some kind of activities I do with uh, children. It's a short movie, two minutes. like to make a live presentation just to tell something and uh, to share my experience on a non-formal education also would like to show some pictures from uh, our workshops I called universe minor and actually I can explain how it started and it started in, in, in quite funny funny way um, five years ago, I published my first book of, of for children called Boomba Doomba and the Creation of the Universe. There was a story you saw of fragments on a movie, uh, a guy like an Eggman or Potato Man or, or a Caveman, whatever else. Uh, he started to explore uh, how the world looks like you are born first day born and and how could you explain the all those things you you find on your way so and the funny thing is that uh, i i'm an architect but i mostly more than than 10 or at least like 20 years i'm working with publishing projects and publishing um, books and doing book designs and also um, uh, doing some research on, on urban design. So and I started explaining the city and the transformation from this uh, plan economy city to we call late capitalistic city where uh, actually everything is privatized and all the public spaces are do not belong to public but where is the problem the problem i saw um very elementary problem that uh, this is um understanding or or consciousness so i used to work with uh, try to work with uh, people fr from business fair from municipality and you just cannot explain them that the city, uh, what, the, what, what is the thing called urban structure or how you could 
look into the old structures, um, palimpsest uh, um, strate strategies and, and things like that, and they don't understand. They said, well, well we, we have territory and we have to build something. That's it. I mean, a square meter understanding of the city we have. Uh, and, and now um, this started with the education, uh, combining things from the book design, from the publishing, um, things from poetry, and I realized that it's a powerful instrument uh, for kids. So I started to build uh, um, short-term programs and long-term programs. Um, let's say uh, one program I just finished uh, in 2016, it was for four months. We had uh, like uh, 16 themes related. You can, what I'm trying to say, the architecture itself, you cannot explore architecture if you, have, uh, you, if you don't understand how things are uh, related to each other. I mean, uh, space is a pro product, but also space is a, is a sequence. You got up early morning and you have uh, your things, then you go outside, you have your things, and your things uh, related to the space. And every person now have um, different space and different understanding of, 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 of its surrounding. So I, I, I realized that uh, building or doing things we usually do in the third or fourth year when you learn architecture, it means when you are at the age of 20 or 22, it's too late. It's too late. I got all the backgrounds of urbanistics uh, at, in the third year when I was a student. So, and now what we do, we do with kids from seven to 12 years, we build houses, we build cities. And that's simple as that. You will see it's, 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 it's attractive and it's, uh, of course, we are not doing things in scale yet. And I find out the problem is we teaching um, kids to read, to calculate, like numbers, two and two, four, but we are not te teaching them to build a small card box. It's a simple thing, but I've, I just find out, and even very smart kids, they don't know how to, what to do with the pencil, how to write, build the line, draw the line, and build the box. And I said, wow, it's, 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 it must be simple. So, and, and it, it goes, and, and I'm just think that, uh, 20 years you need you need to 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 get this to get this uh, understanding that space uh, belongs to everybody and it depends how we call public or private it doesn't really matter actually uh, the the main the main thing is does those do those spaces work for us or not so and my experience is um sharing that knowledge I got from, from, from groups of, of, of children. I, I've got involved in the participation with different institutions, in libraries, in schools. Um, it's a very powerful instrument and we are not teaching just to draw the line. Building the house, cardboard house, you teach some other skills. If you try to uh, teach those skills, it, it becomes boring. No one, no, no one, no one wants to be uh, thought as a, how to draw a good line. It's it's boring thing, you know. But when you build a house, um, step by step, you you get 
get through this. So and and actually, as I, as I say, uh, going to architecture from you can start from from what, whatever you want. You can start from writing poetry, from uh, writing books, or or making music. So thanks. <laughs> <laughs>